Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. You are watching one of my Egypt travel videos and today I'm taking to the catacombs of Qom al Shufaka, date back to the 2nd century AD and were accidentally discovered in 1900 when a donkey got lost. The catacombs are the largest known Roman burial site in Egypt and they consist of three tiers of tombs and chambers cut into bedrock to a depth of 35 meters. The catacombs of Alexandria were originally a private tomb, but later expanded and became a public cemetery. These are one of the mo last major works of construction dedicated to ancient Egyptian religion. Inside the catacombs, the endless tunnels were like a maze and it was impressive how they curved them in the solid rock. The entry was like a spiral staircase. In the old days, the dead bodies were lowered on ropes to the center of the circular shaft. The archaeological site was one of the seven wonders in the Middle Ages. The antechamber, the most important part of the major site, had decorations and statues. It had carvings of the ancient god Anubis, the god of the dead, dressed like a Roman. Thank you for watching this video. There will be more Egypt videos coming up, so I'll see you shortly. Thank you. Look, you got here thousands of years, continuous years. Yeah. You know? Well, you've got Egyptians here that were born. Yes. Was Anubis, he's wearing his crown, the sun desk, and he had the shield of the jackal. And in front of him, on the bed, that is the body of the human. And he started to mummify it. And under the ground, we could see four jars. We called them the Canubic jars. Anubis and that, when was he carved? Yeah, 3,000 years, 4,000 years ago? It was, it, it was not.